The Magic Wand tool is selected by right-clicking on the Quick Selection tool and selecting the Magic Wand option. It is a clever tool as it selects things very automatically. It looks for ranges of colour that are the same based on the number up here under Tolerance. The lower the number, the smaller the range of colours will be tolerated. You can change the number either by using the scroll bar or by entering in the number directly. With the number set fairly low, if I then click on the orange, you'll see it has not done a very good job selecting as there are all these tiny gaps. If I deselect and if I enter a much higher tolerance, go back to my orange and select again, you will see it has done a much better job this time as it is looking for a greater range of colour as the tolerance number is higher. The magic wand is therefore a bit of a mixed bag. Sometimes it works really well, but other times not so well, and it takes practice to work out the tolerance level required. However, it is a really useful tool to know about if you have a picture on a white background, as we have here, or if you have a logo on a white background. The magic wand works well. It becomes a one-click operation to select the image.